tonight's Storm Team forecast with Chief Meteorologist Joe Calhoun. Not a cloud in the sky. Well, what was all that gray stuff then, Joe? Well, it's just the fog out there. You can see the fog just kind of dissipating. Watch as the last couple of hours in the visible satellite imagery is kind of shrinking. You can see the clouds. They're actually moving on the satellite imagery over western Pennsylvania. So as we continue to see this dissipate, we'll continue to see a little more sunshine through the afternoon. Still some dense fog, especially if you're heading up 11 and 15, 322 west on the turnpike. Be careful for it in some areas, but next hour or two, most of that's going to start to dissipate, and we'll see partly sunny skies, a little milder too. 50s, I think a few spots near the Mason Dix line could make a run towards 60 degrees. Get used to it for the next couple of days, it's going to be mild. A little more of that fog forms later on tonight. Uh, partly cloudy and cool otherwise, 30s to around 40 degrees. Again, nothing very cold. In fact, tomorrow quite warm. Uh, temperatures in the mid 50s to near 60 with partly sunny skies after, again, some morning clouds, a little bit of fog early, but I do think things start to dissipate. Showed you the Harrisburg sky cam with still some fog. Look at that. A lot of sunshine over York right now, and that is starting to warm things up, up to 49 at this hour. Winds are calm. Keep in mind our normal high for this day. 43. So we're already well above the normal. Here are the visibilities now. Everybody over a mile, Harrisburg to Sealands Grove, a little, little more dense, but still not bad. Predictor showing visibilities improving as we go through the afternoon. The evening, a little bit of haze out there up to 9 or 10 o'clock. Overnight tonight, we may see some more of that fog, especially eastern sections where visibilities could get back under a mile again. So you're going to watch for that. But I don't think it's going to be as dense. I think there's a little more of a breeze later on tonight. 45 in Lebanon right now, but it's already 55 in Gettysburg. Still 50 degrees in uh, Carlisle. Pretty good looking day out there at this hour. Nothing on the radar, just that fog. There are clouds to the west. It's a frontal boundary, but it doesn't look like it's going to get here. Look at the temperatures. It's hard to find any cold air over the northeast or the Great Lakes. The southerly flow continues. That's going to give us more sunshine. This front won't get here. It'll stall out to our north. we will continue in this southerly flow probably right on into the weekend. That's going to keep it fairly mild. There'll be some clouds and fog each morning, I think. But look at the temperatures getting up to near 60 degrees and maybe even setting some records by the time we get to Sunday. Depending on cloud cover, we could be in the mid-60s, breaking the old record of 63 on Sunday. Monday's not bad, even with rain coming in, but then it does turn cooler. You notice I said cooler. I mean, 50 degrees for next this Tuesday, time of year? Wow. and that's the cooler day. All right. You ready for lunch? I'm all, you know, right. I'm always ready. Right. How about the lunch ladies? You remember them? Yeah. <laughs> all right. Well, school lunches aren't the only thing cooking in the cafeterias of some Susquehanna Valley high schools.